So let's go read it. So it's Kagami ni into the mirror. Isuta no, the thing that was reflected in the mirror, ga is um, the dirty thief. So dorobo, datta, it was. The thief is described as being uh, ki, uh, kitanai, kitanai, dirty thief, datta, it was. The dirty thief is the thing that was reflected in the mirror. Pagami Perfect. ni suzutta no. Utsutta. U -tsu. U. U -tsu -ta. U -tsu -ta. Reflected. Hi. Can you read this word Hai. for me? Hitomi. Hitomi. Hi. So the hitomi, you know, for all our purposes, is basically the same as me which is I, literally hitomi means pupil, like the pupil of your eye. However, in most occasions, you wouldn't translate it as pupil because in English, we don't use the word pupil all that much. So there's a lot of times where instead you'd use the word hitomi, which means pupil, where in English, we would use the word I as a translation. So in our context, it's definitely going to be I is how we would translate into English. But this specifically is used because um, your pupil, right? is the part of your eye that you use to like look at things right you can't look at the white of your eye right you can't you can't see out of there so in japanese they're just more specific when they're referring to certain things the eyes are doing by specifically always using hitomi in certain compasses and me and other compasses um how do you read this kanji hitomi hitomi right. perfect let's go read the example sentence Yojimbo no a a a oi a oi hitomi wa kire the the people the blue pupil of the bodyguard is pretty kire da it is pretty hi. So you see how that makes sense. In English, we never really say the word pupil. So we normally would say the blue eye, but obviously the white of the eye is blue. So, hitomi. <laughs> um, do you know what tokoro ga means? Tokoro referring to a place. And time. And time. Tokoro ga is the time and the place that the door akanai. That's a good guess. Ga open. as a particle does not mark like at, right? Um, in this context, this ga is more like kama ga, the ga that occurs at the end of a sentence, I would say, as, as far as like the meaning of it, right? Like desu ga. So it's kind of like tokoro dakero. So it's kind of more like manga akenai. Manga. Akenai. The door did not open. Hi. It was at that time, but the door was not open. Good it's guess. A, it's a post So true, that is a it's time not... where it's like, it was like, even though it was that time, it's more what it's saying, right? Ga means however, when it's at the end of a sentence, right? It's like, kedo. Oh. Right? Um, so this right here just means even okay. so, however, blah, 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 that kind of word. So it's kind of like a demo type of idea. It's not as aggressive as demo, but it's basically, it, it, it tends to be used in almost a by the way type of way, but more in an even so. This specific context, probably magi the Majitsi Nebari probably did a magical spell to open the gate, but the gate did not open. So the Tokuroga says, even though he was doing this action at this time, basically, even though he cast the spell at the location in front of the gate, the gate was not opening, is basically what, what it's saying. Um, can you read this example sentence for me? Tokoro ga kagami ni nani ka utsutte ita. At the time, however, the 
something was reflected was that that something was reflected in the mirror perfect do you was, know what an all is Oh, here referring to a tail or it the, is a tail or the, or the bum. bottom is the cd cd has the number q inside of it so that would be um right here this is or cd so cd has nine inside of it what does tail have inside of it tail had the um the hair the hair character so yes, the it does. fur character which is oh okay oh for tail let's go with the example okay. sentence oh. Oh, this is like mot motsu. Oh, Hi. Kuroi. Kuroi. Um, this is neko. Hi. Neko no. Nama. 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 You just would say nawa. Nam Nama no, is na nawa. the word name, but you can just say na as well. Nawa. Uh, ready, ready, da, ready, da. The cat, the name of the cat, the name of the black cat that has the tail. What's, what's it? The name of the black cat with the tail is Ready, Lady. Perfect. Hi. Can you read this word for me? Rejireru. Rejireru. Hi. So this. Kind of means crooked in this context. It's going to be referring to a crooked tail, like the crooked tail that a cat can have. Like that. Bow, bow. Um, what's the te form of nejiru? It's te form with nejiru. Nejiru. So this has got to be a root verb. So nejiru de. No glad to stop. Perfect. Let's go read the example sentence. Nachiretao, the crooked tail, to Aoi, he told me, the people with the eye, the blue eye, the blue people. Aoi, he told me, oh, Motsu, Nezumi wa, uh, ki, uh, kirenai. No, no, kiranai. Kik. Was it dirty again? It's kitanai. 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 Um, the mouse with the blue eye and the and the crooked tail is dirty. So it's kitanai is dirty. It's not unclean. Hi. Perfect. Dirty. It's dirty. Can you read this word for me? Yaseru. Yaseru. Something about being. This is a negative word of with the sick character be. in front. I guess. Probably yes, not. Yes, it is. Mm, yes, it is means um. It's it, a lot of times it'll be this will be called um to lose weight. That is because if you have it in te form, that's what it means. Yasete iru is to be losing weight. What do you think yaseta means? Losing. If yes, it didn't mean to lose loss. weight. But in English, you would just would say weight. they're skinny. So, yaseta means skinny. Yaseteiru means to become skinny. It's to be active, becoming skinny, to be losing weight. Yaseta. So, yaseta. this kind of. Yaseta. Yaseta. Hi. So, yaseta. if you ever see yaseta, Hi. it just means skinny. So, that's the same with futoru. Do you have to know what futoru means? Futoru meaning to gain weight. Hi. Well, so what does futota mean? mean? Uh, fat. Does mean fat. Hi. So it's that same kind of idea. Do, do, do. What is the ta form of yasedu? Te form. Root verb. Yasete. Hi. Yasete. Yasete. Let's go read the line from the book. So here's tokoro ga eta tan. However, itomi ni utsute ita no wa. The thing that was reflected in the mirror was uh, kira kira. Kira kira shita. What is kira kira shita? Aoi, he told me. To. 
レジタを持つ痩せたマクロな子、忘れな子、猫 ?It can't be 猫 ?It has to be、oh, 子猫。Okay. I don't think Neko has a married reading. Hi. So, kira kira is an onomatopoeia like sound with the verb sudu so that we can use it as a relative clause, aka adjective clause, to describe the noun. Stomi. Stomi. So, here he told me is kira kira. So, it's like、yes. littering. Exactly. You knew exactly what it is. It's, it's light coming out of it, and it's a blue、uh, pupil with glittering blue pupil with a、Hi. crooked tail that was described as being nachireta. O in this motsu. So it has a crooked tail, and that which is having a crooked tail is this koneko, the little cat, that is makuro na, meaning it's truly black. It's of Complete black, it doesn't have any mixed color, and it's yaseta, meaning that it's skinny. Hi, perfect. And what does koneko mean rather than cat? Do you know what better word we might use? A kitten, a kitten. Hi, perfect. Yep, that is what is reflected in the mirror,、so、not a nezemi nor a gokiburi. Do you know what a gokiburi, gokiburi. is? A cockroach. So, a not cockroach. a cockroach. Gokiburi. Do you know what fusawashi nor is it an means? Hi, hi. Fusawashi. Here is the adjective saying that the, it's, it's a suitable. That which is. Yes. Perfect. How about、suited. nozoku? Here, nozoku is a verb. Here, it's, so it's nozoite. It does. So here it's nozo. Nozoku is to get on something. Hold on, Moni. I think I know this.、Nope. So it's iwareta toori chikazu nozoite mita. To try to do what? To try to. Ah. Nozoku.、Mm. Nozoku means to peak. To peak. In this context, the peek into the kagami. He's, he's, he tried to peek. He, making a, he attempted to peek and he said, Wow, I don't know. Hi. Honshinda. That's my、okay. true form. Can you read this word for me? Dokeru. Hi, that is to move out of the way. Dokeru. What's the tef form? Dokeru. Dokete. はい。Nebudi wa kagami o dokete, he moved the mirrors away. And、uh, isu, isu ni onto the chair, suari, he sit down on the chair.、Uh, Kochi o, this way, mi o roshita.、Uh, what does he do? Mi and then o roshita. He d o something towards me, which、Hi. is to do with looking of some sort. Or do she mean look up or look down? Oh, he's、Hi. looking down because the cat is、Hi. below him. So, so, so. Or do she die? Look downward. And now he's speaking. He's saying, Kozo, boy, Zui Bun. Umaku. Umaku from Umai, meaning good. Hi. And this umaku describing it's an adverb, so it describes a verb of some sort. Zuibun is completely all of it.、Uh, henshin no jitsu. So the transformation technique ni kakatanada. Kakatana. He basically s a y that the, the spell, 
transformation spell had completely worked for Maki. Hi, hi. It, it worked super well. It kept that in a in a Maki way, which is so, so. completely successful. Zubin. Perfect. Can you read this word for me? Mm -hmm. This here referring to like the toes or the tip of the toes. Hi. Or the area right in front of the Toes and here referring to it just to means the, toes. The, the foot. Hi. It is toes, so it's claw and saki, but it doesn't read as saki. It read as no thin, it's saki. Like in sensei. It's saki. It's saki. Okay, so then the other reading is also a kun reading mm -hmm. for claws, which is what was it? Kubi. Good guess. Kubi. It's tsuma. It's, so Tsuma is actually a special Friends of Benefits reading. It can also be read as Tsume when it's on its own. Can you read this word for me? Here is like ki, as in kiko, like to listen. So it's kiki, agasu. Hi. Listen so, the cross. Nagasu listen does cross. not mean the cross. What does nagasu mean? Or maybe You're it's thinking about to flow, water. to flow. To flow, yes. This is specifically to make flow. So you're listening and you're making something flow means that you're paying no attention. You're ignoring something. You're specifically making all the sound just flow right by your ears. Okay. Can you read this example sentence for me? Ignore the words that is of the who is the Furochi. A, a child that was It's a child, yes. It's an orphan. It's a Furochi. Yes. It is an orphan child with no horn. Furoji, a street urchin. Furoji. What is the stem form of this word? We take the stem form from the kimas form. So it's kikinaga. Su is an u verb. So then stem form would take the e form. So it's kikinagashi. Hi. Can you read this word for me? This one here is either iki standing for breath so it's iki oh i'm sorry no this one is ugoku Hi. so it's ugokasu perfect to Make move something move. Hi. can you read this word for me and here is the sume from the suma so Hi. here is kagi sume is kagi referring to a metal thing of some sort Sume is the claws uh, or the toes, so hi. something that was worn is where. Good guess. Um, toes. kagitsume just means claws or um talon, but it is true that is a possible kanji to use if you're referring to a needle, but it's probably more like a stinger if you're using it for that or a hook or something like that. It's not really used on its own to a. Uh, mean that it's it's normally like a word you're yeah, so choosing them, a... i guess feel more animal like oh, oh, oh. this is a kagi sume zume kagi zume hi. It is, it is a kagi zume. Hi. A kagi it probably zume. makes the claw feel like it should be a little bit curved Pro probably gives a little bit of that vibe I... yeah. Curve, curve, kagi zume, kagi zume. Okay. Um, so, so it started with kagi. What did it end with? Kagi, claws, zume, claws. So talent, talents, kagi zume. Hi. And so let's go read the example sentence. I mean, the sentence from the book. So, so the genbun is ore wa nebari no kotoba o kiki. Nagashi. I ignore the word of Nebari. 
足を上げて、lift up the foot, lift up the leg, 動かしてみた。I try to lift my feet. And, うわぁ、鍵、ズメが、the claws, 飛び出した、came out. So when I lift my feet, the claws came out. はい。Uh, what is me, Oro Sumi? In fact, はいはいはい。Uh, I, it kind of fl fly out, so it c o m e out in a very quick manner. That's why it's,、yes. he, he uses Tobi Dash. It's Tobi. It jumped out, I'm sorry. Claw jumped out.、Uh, Mioroshi is meaning he looked down. Orosi is from Orosu to go down. Hi, perfect. Look down, look downward. Yoshita. What does Orewa... Hineru mean? Kata o Hinete. Kata Hinete. イネルイネルイネルイネルイネルイネルイネルイネルイネルイネルイネルイネルイネルイネルイネルイネルイネルイネルイネルイネルイネルイネルイネルイネルイネルイネルイネルイネルイネルイネルイネルイネルイネルイネルイネルイネルイネルイネルイネルイネルイネルイネルイネルイネ Um, ure no shita o kugutte, nebri ga kieta do e hashteita. So, what was happening is that there was a minion who was holding on to Khan, and Khan kicks them in the shin, does kata o hineru, and then the, gets、um, his hand released, the, the hand, in this case, the hand of the teshita, releases the main character, and then he passes underneath the minion. And runs off toward where Neveri disappeared. Do you have a second guess what kata o hineru might mean? So here, then, hineru m e a n referring to the shrugging of the shoulder. He shrugged yes, off. Yes, it's that wrenching, the, the shrugging off your stomach. Hi,、mm -hmm. perfect. Do you know what this bolded、mm -hmm. word is? Hineru, hineru, right? The bolded word is shiro. Hi, ushiro. What does ushiro mean? He's turning around. Hi. The, so, no, to the back. Hi. Can you read this example、Ushiro. sentence for me? Orwa kubi o. That is a kubi. That is a head or the neck. Hi. So, orwa kubi o. Ushiro ni towards the backside. He h e n i t a meaning he shrugged. He shrugged towards the backside. And the thing that he shrugged is the neck. So he's turned his neck as if he's turning the shoulder, but here he's turning the neck. Hi. In this context, would you say this is a slow turn or a fast turn?、Mm. It's a fast turn. It's a he n e c k It's he r e n c e s his neck all the way to the back. He whips it, in other words. What does ato mean? It's a whipping. Hinete is a whipping of the movement. Like, ato is an after, it's a time phrase. Hi. After. Hi. It can also mean behind. Like, ushiro. It just depends on context.、Okay. Can you read this bolded word for me? Ushiro. Here is chikan. This is referring to the time, specifically the time. Chikan. Specifically the time. Hi. You know what nagameru means? Nagamete. Uh, in context, in Changande. What is this? Susudarake Nanua. Danrono and Mika Kate Tasen Mika. Nagamete Pita. I don't remember money. Susudarake. n a g a m e r u means to gaze at something. That tends to be a hard word for you. Do you know what nozoku means? Nozoku is to、uh, peak. Perfect. Peak.
Can you read this kanji for me? Peek into gaze. Always to gaze at some things. This hi, is Nagameru. Either behind or after. Hi, hi. Uh, so in hi. this context, it's still ushiro. But here it's ato, does meaning after as in later in time. So let's go read the example sentence. It's he saying that the gathering of the magician it's when it's it's in one after. It's one hour. It's in one hour. After it's, yep. It's one the, hour. The current it's in time. one hour. Hi, hi. It's in one hour. And ore wa kibu o ushiro ni. So I, the neck, towards the back, hineri, whips it. I whips my, my head back. Uh, nechi, neta, the crooked or tell the crooked tell chige chige to na ga meta nagameta is to gaze hi to gaze in a chige chige to it's fixedly so then fixedly so i gaze fixedly at the crooked tail and I and he go, mm, yes, kakoi, this really good. Mm, kakoi, super cool. Hi. Hi. Is the main character listening to Nevery? Nevery's like, ah, oh, yes, the meeting is in one hour. I whip my head back and I stare at my tail. Con's pretty distracted. Shige, shige. Yeah. Shige, shige. Shige, shige. shige, shige to. Um, can you read this word for me? This is shōzai, shōzai. Hi. Bookshelf. Uh, close. It's a room that might have bookshelves in it, but it's not a library. Uh, office. Shōzai. It is an office. Hi. Do you know how to read this word up here, which means large billing? To. To is the tower. Hi. To. Can you read this word for me? Hi. Shōryui means documents. Something you find in a shō side. Sorry, with shō, what did it end with? Rui. Perfect. So Let's go read the example documents. sentence. Yep. Shōryui. So here is Higure no. The Twilight Kimi. Higure no Twilight kimi. Lord. Higure no Kimi wa. Sho gurui guru i document sorui sorui o yonda yaku document yonda sorui yonda sorui o yonda he read the document hi do you know what mekuru means mekutte mekuru and then followed by Okiagata. Up, get up, and then make it there. The context this won't help mofu. super much with Mekuru here. Like, he is Mekuruing the Mofu, but that's not the most common way you use Mekuru. It just was the first time I think we've seen Mekuru was used with Mofu. But I wouldn't say it's a common vocab word. So, Mekuru means in this context to peel. But it actually means to flip, like to flip pages in a book. So here he's peeling off his blanket from himself. He's flipping the blanket so it's not on him anymore. But normally it's used like to flip through pages of a book or perhaps pages of a shōrui. Can you read this word for me? Mekuru, mekuru, mekuri dasu. Hi, mekuri dasu. Any idea? Hi. Hi. Dasu is from the coming out. 
to 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 bring something out. So here is Mercury. Flip and bring something out. To so flip and to bring something dasu out. can to mean to make something appear. That is correct. In this case, you're right. It's to start. Is the hachimete meaning of the dasu? So it's like Hai. to begin in actions. Hai. The start of an dasu action. Dasu tends to occur rather than hajimedu if there's an assumption that the person was doing the action before and they just had it on pause before restarting it. So it's a little bit similar to nausu. Um, that just tends to be it. So it could be like mekuri hajimedu if he just began of the first day of flipping through, but maybe he was flipping through something and then he went over to do something real quick and then went back to do it, then the dasu is more likely to occur. Uh, do you know how to read this word? This is the form of a thing. Hi. It's the kata, it's the sagata, hakata. Su, sugata. Okay. Su, sugata. It's the right. form it's the of something. physical appearance of something. Hi. Let's go read the example that. sentence. Um, Duchess. On the cho Choko. Choko. Cho. Onna. Onna. This is onna. Onna. Ko. Koshaku. Koshaku. Is that's the Dutch? So on the koshaku, wa, mm. sho, and then rui, sho rui o, mekuri dashita. So started to flip the documents. The Dutchess started to flip the documents. Hi, yep. The Duchess started a flip through the duck box. Do you know what Nareru means? Na -e -e. To cross something, to go through. No. Nareru means to be familiar with. Nareru, to be familiar with. Hi, and it is a new verb. How do you read this kanji? Na from nareru. Hi. Na no nareru. What's the te form? Nareru no no. And this is the te form of a ru verb. So it's na re te. Hi, nareru. Perfect. Let's go read this example sentence. So here it is ore wa kono. Atarashi sugata ni nare na kereba nara na inda. So let me read it. Okay, read again. Uh, the main verb here is nare. Nare. Hi. You know what na kereba nara nai means? Na kereba nara nai meaning it must be. Hi, I must, ore wa nakereba naranai. Mm. I must what? Nareru. Nakereba naranai nareru. Be familiar with. You must be familiar with. Hi, with what? With this, kono, kono atarashi sugata ni. With this form, this new form. Hi. I must be familiar with this new form. Perfect. Nakereba. Naranai. Hi. Nareru. Nareru. Do you know Hi. what yaru means? Yaru is the action verb to carry an action. But here Hi, it's to mean do. to do. But usually What's the for negative form? Nai. Nai. So here is yaranai. Yara. Perfect. Nai. Yaranai. Hi. Perfect. Um, do you know what yoi means? Yoi is e. Hi, perfect. So let's go read so the line from the book. Good. Hi. 
All right, look at that. Um, this is a quote. It says, Sore Madani. And to that, Atarashi Sugata ni Nareru ga Yoi. So in this Fears case, the, the Sore is referring to a Jigan, but that's very context based. Remember what the previous so, sentence said? Sore. What did Neverdy say in the last sentence? Do you remember? The, the the phrase that nobody say was that the um i need some review as well so basically Hi. he said that kaigi the kaigi Hi. that is the meeting mm -hmm. uh the mado ma no kaigi wa ichikan ato da Ichi it is in one hour Hi. so so the made is meaning what the made here is until Hi. That time. Exactly. So un so basically for the next hour until the meeting for starts. Next, until the meeting. Sore made ni. Atarashi sugata ni. Towards your new form. Um, it would be good. He say ga yoi. Hi. He's saying that it would be good. Um, that you do this. You nageru. That you become familiar with. Nageru ga yoi. Then he say, Kochi mo. Um, basically, he referring to himself now. Hi. Yaraneba. From yaru to do. But here Hai. is the uh, conjugation of the conditional eba form. Hi. So it's yaraneba nara nu. Hi. Is the negative form from Hi. nai, but now it's conjugated with the conditional eba form. So it's yara neba nara nu. Um, is he saying I must do? I must do. Hi. Do what? what? he says. A thing. He's he must do a thing called koto ga aru. So I have. A task, he referring to a task that he has to do. Exactly. Um, now he end that quote and now back to the narrative. So it's saying, Nebari wa, if nebari is the topic here, soi to you, soi you, soi you to. Now is defined as that nebari in that way. Hmm? What does iu mean? So iu to, iu is like like an e equivalent form. Oh it no no no! This is just. It can mean that. However, with this context of the comma, that insinuates it's not to you, but instead it's to, which means immediately after, and this is probably the verb iu rather than to you. So so to ita, right? But in this case, it would be o because we're not being direct. Hi, nobody say. The, uh, the the thing that he just said Hi. and immediately uh table no soru yo megri dashita here it say that he started again he's like he was reading a document before now he continued Hi. the Perfect. show the document on the table or off the Perfect. table Hi. And how do you, um, what does hineru mean? It's like the turning of the shoulder of the Hai, whipping of the wrenching. neck. It's a whipping Hai. motion. Hai. What does nagameru mean? Naga meru. is to, to stare. He's nagame, he's Hai. stare. Perfect. And what does naranuba naranai mean? This is the neburi way of saying yara nereba nara nai. But he say nara nu, meaning I must do. Yes, I must perfect. do. There's, there's the thing that I must do. You know what tabi means? Like tabi ni? Ichida nagaru tabi ni? Kore ga mayagaru. From ichido. Um.
a tabi had nothing to do with the journey, right? Like tabi, tabi from like totally normal different tabi kanji. Like... Tabi as a journey has this kanji. So this referring to like time of Hi. how many times one does something, right? Yes. So tabi Every means time. is like every time. Hi. Every time I go it. up a step, dust yeah. flies up. Agaru, agaru, agaru. Every time Hi. I go up a step, tabi ni. Hi. Wakata. You know what shibaraku means? Uh, I know this one. Why am I forgetting? Shibaraku is... It's a time is, um, phrase. Shibaraku. Uh, hold on. Context is say, ore wa shirabaku. Uh, I forgot. Hi, shibaraku means for the time being or for some period of time. It tends to be a long period of time rather than a short period of time. But it lets you know there's been a pause. So for some period of time, he jitto shiteita. You know what jitto means? meaning fixedly right like, yes. like she, she, she get, she get. be still Hi. fix he fixed what he sit he was still. it means the whole to time be he was still hi hi basically he pauses for a time he was freezing for a bit hi and now it's a Kase, kase, right? Kase, kase? Or is it kasa, kasa? Kasa, kasa. Kasa, kasa to. Page yo. This is mean that he's flipping through the pages in a quick Hi, way. Isn't he's mekuring them. Kasa, kasa. Um, kasa, kasa them. is the sound of the page, which is not really a speed. It's just that the paper is very um dry. So he's kasa kasa to page yo meguru. He turning them, and this meguru is now modifying oto ga. So the sound is suru tabi ni. Every single time that he going through the page, the sound there's a sound. It's oto ga suru. Hi. Um. Then. Now this phrase is o o biku biku sase tari. His tail, something is, he's doing something to the tail. Hi, he's twitching um, But it. here he's ref referring to Khan. Khan is doing the sase tari, which is biku biku sase tari. What is that, Moni? Hi, piku piku means twitch. You like, know what suru means? Twitch, twitch. Okay, so it's twitching mm -hmm. of a muscle and then sase tari. Hi, how did suru turn into saseru? Hi, saseru. So this is the causing, the causative form of suru. Hi, yes, the main character causes the tail to piku piku. But then the tari is. Ah, so you add the to ta form to mean etc. when you're listing a group of adjectives. So it's the same as ya for nouns. So he saseta followed by ri, modifying Hi. the verb to mean he causes the twitch. Hi. Um, and also other things. So it's pika, pika, sasetari, comma, mimi o, ukashitari, ukashita. The moving of the ear. So he's doing something to the ear. He move it. Hi. And he shitemiru. He's trying to move it. He's taking a tap. He tries to do things such as twitching his ears and twitching his tail. But it literally just is moving his ears. Um, 
Yeah, so he tries to move his ears and so, he also tries to twitch his tail around. Here he say, Ukashi Tari. Such a Hi. thing, the re, as in like the itemization of the action. So here is, Hi. Ukashi ta move and shite miru. This, so shite miru is describing both ugakashita and Hai. sase tari. Correct. You kind of need a sudo after tari as that's like the verb to do. So to do this and that. Uh, Hi. I feel like so this is the first time I met this grammar form. It might the tari, tari. be the first time you've met this grammar form. Okay. Feels like it. Tari tari. Shitsu tari. And then another tari. It's definitely possible. It's... It might have been something I just assumed you would learn outside of class. <laughs> That's the thing. Sometimes I forget. Uh, I feel like it's a relatively early vocab word, but I have no idea. It could be year two for all I know, not year one. I, um, I definitely can't this... across the she. Like the she? itemizations of noun, like she, she, the the she at the end of a a phrase, the the, the etc. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I feel like it's that, taught weirdly yeah. in school. That's she, but yeah, etc. She that is so common. Right. More this common than tiny. Hey. Yep, a hey. Nice. What is an a hey? Bodyguard. Or the, uh, not so much bodyguard, but um, hi, the, hi, 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 you're right. A soldier, a guard. guard of the city. Hi. Do you know what uh, tsukamaru means? This to grab, to hold on to something. Tsukamaru. Uh, tsukamaru. Tsuk tsukamaru. It says tsukamaru, which looks to be captured. very similar. To be captured, yes. It seems like I was about to be captured by a soldier. Can you read this so word for me? Ninata. Hey, so, sukamaeru. To be captured. Sukamaeru. Hi. Um, what's the te form of tsukamaeru? This is a root verb, so it's sukamae de. Hi, without a little stop. De. So, let's go read the example sentence. So, ehe wa. Uh, this is the dorobo. Ehe wa dorobo o tsukamaeta. The guard captured the thief. So the guard, Perfect. the thief captured. First, the subject here is that. Hi. Um. So the tsukamae tsukamaru here is ehe ni. So by the guards, right? Ni as a tool used. So the subject here would be I. I am about to be captured by the guard. Versus this one, o. Right. The apprentice is captured. So if there was a knee hmm. here, then uh, that's basically how you tell. Knee is the end of a verb. So it's like who does the action in that kind of context of the like passive and passive type of idea. Do you know how to say above the hmm. head? Atama. Hi. But it's not Ish. read as atama. Zoo. Ah. Uh. This is the um, mirror reading, so it's zu sho or zu jo. Hi, zu jo, perfect. Can you read this word for me? Zo? Hi, Hi. zu jo. Jo, zu jo, zu jo. Hi, tamaranai, tamaranai, e adjective, tamaranai. Hi, tamaranai means I cannot stand it. Maranai. Maranai. Cannot okay. stand. Perfect. Cannot stand. Gambo. Oh. Let's go read the line from the book. We say that it's not atama, but it's sujo. Hi. Sujo. Sujo. Sujo kara from above the head. Sujo kara bara bara to. What does he do? He brings something down. Is it? Maybe wait till no, you hit. Oh, you mean how to read this? That's furi. Furu. 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 
il faut te quitter. Son cru. Faut te quitter. Hokori o. Soto hokori. Ok, hokori o. Sukamaeta. Captured by. Kute. Tamaranai. I cannot stand. Um, being grabs. Good guess. Go backward. Boop, 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 boop. Skamaidu. To capture something. Takes O capture. for what you are capturing. Hi. Here we have the, paka, the particle O. Kori. I cannot stand. Tamara nai. Cannot stand. Sukamae takite. Takte. Hi. Tai. Takite. From Tai. Wanting to capture Okori. Yes. Which thus can he not stand wanting to. Cannot stand at how much he wants to capture it. Cannot stand wanting. Hi. Cannot stand wanting to capture, meaning ones truly, really want to capture something. Hi, 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 hi. So, sukamae takte, tamara night. What is it that I want? I want the hokori. Which dust? Um, Khan is wanting... That's a relative clause. Describes the noun mm -hmm. dust. Okori is the dust. Hi. Or dust. Fute is to fall. So it's the falling dust. Kita is towards the speaker. Hi. That so is correct. Dust coming and... down. Hi. Coming from the sujo kara, from above the head. Perfect. The hokori coming down. Right. And para para doesn't really matter. Soon. That's just the sound effect of dust falling from the ground. You can kind of imagine it's going to be very my kind of way, like very like a, right? It's not going to be like, poop, right? It's not like a ball dropping. It's dust kind of flutters down. Para para, para para para. So. Hi. He, I want to capture the dust that's falling down from above my head. Um, I can't help myself. I cannot withstand it. Can you read this word for me? Oi kaketa. To catch was... up. Yes, to catch up. Perfect. Can you read this for me? Oi, oi, sumeru. Hi. This sumeru referring to the asking of something. No. Or is it, no, no, this is not at all. Sumeru here referring to. We have seen this sumeru before in this book. It means to stuff stuff inside of something, to cram stuff. Okay. Sumeru is to cram. Okay. Or it's sumeru, to cram up, to cram. To catch up in the cr and cram. Hi. So this means to corner something. You're chasing something, okay. allowing you to pack it up in the corner. Oi, tsumeru. Hi. Can you put this into te form for me? Oi, oi, tsumeru. Te form is a good verb. So oi, tsumete. Hi, oi, tsumete. Perfect. Do you know what a sumi is? Oi. Yubi sasu. Hi. Heya no sumi. Point, pointing at the sumi. So, Hai. therefore, the sumi is something that is of the heya. Hi. That you can point so at. It has to be a piece of furniture or the features of the room. Hi. Your hint is that it is a feature that every room has. Then it has to be a corner of the room. Sumi. It is the or corner. The hi. Sumi it's means sumi. corner. Hi. But hi. Moni reminds me. Hi. Kado is a corner hi. of a shape. Um, so the weird difference between these 
is that Kado, so if you're in here, right, there's no Kados of a room, even though it means corner. It, it's a different kind of thing. So rooms have Sumi, right? These are, these are all Sumis. You can have a Kado like this in a hallway. This is a Kado, this turn right here is the, the coder. Um, there's, 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 there's also angle, which has the same kanji, right? But I guess you could say the point here is actually this outside angle, right? So even hmm. though a rectangle has um, four corners, you could argue it's arguing about the outside corners rather than the sumi corners, or specifically it's talking about the angles, which is, um, Kaku, right? Kaku is angle pronunciation. Um, but kado is corner, but as in the outside corner of something. Sumi is always inside. It's the it's a little nook is another way you could translate this. It's a nook. Um, but yeah, ka, you can't you can't the... refer to the corners of a room as a kado. Uh, quick question. So Hi. the kado, the kanji for kado is also read as another kanji for Hi. horn. Kaku? Yes, like that's horn. tsuno. You're correct. Tsuno. Tsuno. Hi. And you see tsuno, horns horn. poke out of the head. Got an outward angle so right the there. the kado poke out of the figure. Hi. Exactly. The same way that the tsuno poke out of the animal head. Hi, hi, hi. And then Gado is the third reading, right, Mani? Hi. Kado, Kado is, is is the outside corner and Kaku is angle. Like C Kaku is a is, rectangle. Kado is the outer corner. Kaku is the angle of a figure. Hi. And Suno is the horn and here the simi is the nook of the room Hi. exactly Look at that. can you read this for me simi simi ko. Hi. no difference in sumi also just means the nook or the corner um it just feels a little bit i'd say childish but it's same same idea um let's go read the line from the book Neko wa okori o the dust. Mm -hmm. Sumiko ni he towards the corner of the corner. Ah, uh, oi tsumetai corner the cat. Corners is the du the dust. Hi. At the corner. Exactly. He chases that dust into the corner and corners it in there. What's the Thai form for want of tu, uh, oi tumeru? So we just take it straight from the Thai form. So it's Hi. Um, oi tsumetai. Hi, perfect. Um, dare tsuku is um, a word that kind of means like to play around, but it's a very specific play around word. It's only used to refer to um, animals playing around. It has a um, like a coil around a clinging type of like feeling, but like a child or an animal doing it, not like an adult doing it. So it's tsuku from oh, to yeah. attach. Uh, what's the te form? Is tsuku. Hi. What is the word for like mm -hmm. a toy money? It's had something to do with Omocha? cha. Omocha. Hi. That's a toy. Hi. Here's the play. So it's yeah, chare. but in a hi. Chare nuku. Okay. Chare. Te form of the ku verb. So it's chare tsuite. Hi. So let's go read the line from the book. The gamba. Hi. Here say that nya or nya nya no oh nya 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 
Meow. Meow. To. Here's the sound verb. So it's na oi. Naite. Na. Naite. Meow. Meow. Naite. Hokori ni. Hijaretsuki. So he play with the dust. Hi. Hokori ni jaretsuki. Doko, doko ka no sumi ko ni. What is this? Doka no. Doko ka no sumi. Somewhere. Doko ka no. Sumi ko, the nook of some, some nook, ni. Oitsumetai, I want to chase it Hi. towards some corner. I want to chase it towards some corner. Um... To play with it. Hokori ni cha jaresuki. Perfect. Want to, so, to play out of with curiosity, it. is the kind of playing of jaresuki, would you say that is A, like throwing a ball and something chases after it? B, like when you give a cat, like one of those like food thingies and they just spat it like a bit? Or C, when the cat's about to pounce on something? Which Which one do you think? It's more of the kind of vibe that Jaretsuku is giving us. So here we're referring to the Hokiri, which is which are dust. Yeah. So, but I'm guessing because he is a cat, and therefore, I would say C, because he wants to chase it into the corner. Right. It's it's not really the C. It's after he pounces on it. It's the Jaretsuki is like has this like. The is more like B of when the cat's like has it in its hand and is playing with it. Kind of like when you have like the cat with the mouse and it's just kind of he 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 doing that kind of thing. Because it has a little bit of a clinging uh, vibe to it. So the cat would probably see, but right when it jumps on it, that's that's the so it's not the before jumping, but the after jumping would be jade ticket. But when the cat jumps on something, it normally does some kind of batty type of thing with it so it's more of the batting kind of idea basically it starts clinging to the thing so it's a very playful cling so it's not like clinging like i'm scared uh. it's very much cat ah, wah, 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 type of playing Hi. and that is where we're going to 